quick. Drop a like on the video and subscribe to the channel in the next five seconds. Otherwise, all your skins will get deleted in Fortnite. Yo, what is up guys? My name is iMac, and in this video, I'm going to be telling you the new coming back return release date for Fortnite Mobile on the App Store. That is right guys, Fortnite Mobile is going to be returning to the App Store very soon. In this video, I'm going to be telling you the return release date and absolutely everything you need to know about it. You guys genuinely do not want to miss this. But just before we get into it, I would like to let you guys know that I do gift my subscribers all the time here on the channel. So if you would like the chance to receive a free gift from me in Fortnite, all you have to do is smash the like button down below and subscribe to the channel with the post notification bell turned on. Once you've done that, comment your Epic Games username down below in the comment section so I can add you guys on Fortnite and of course send you a free gift. Alright, so as you guys know, Fortnite Mobile was taken off the App Store a couple of months ago because Epic Games implemented a new direct payment system which was against Apple's terms of service. This new direct payment system was good for players because it meant we got a reduced V-Bucks cost, but Apple didn't like it because now they didn't get their cut on V-Buck purchases. Fortnite Mobile was also taken away from the Google Play Store, but Android users are very lucky because they can still download Fortnite from the official Epic Games launcher. Unfortunately, Apple only allows you to download apps from the App Store itself, so that's why iOS players can't download Fortnite anymore. If we take a look at this tweet from FNBRHQ, it says Apple has responded to Epic Games in their legal battle and is now seeking an unspecified amount in damages. According to Apple, Epic Games has earned over $900 million through the App Store and Apple has taken around $300 million just for the use of the store. And oh my goodness guys, that is honestly insane. Fortnite has made almost $1 billion just from the App Store alone. That's a crazy number. Of course, Apple has taken 300 million of the 900 million dollars, which is kind of fair because when Epic Games signed up to use the App Store, they agreed to the terms of service. Now, if we take a look at this tweet from China BR, it says, fun fact, Fortnite has lost 60% of its player base since it was removed from the App Store. 116 million of the 350 million Fortnite players are playing on iOS. So if all players were still active, Fortnite has already lost 70 million players since it was removed. That's insane guys, the fact that Fortnite is still losing players because it's not on the App Store is honestly insane, and Epic Games is still doing nothing about it. By the way guys, let me know down below in the comment section what platform you guys play Fortnite on. Personally, I do play on the Xbox One, but I'm sure a lot of you guys might play mobile, so please let me know down below. Now, if we take a look at this tweet from FNBRHQ, it says Apple has confirmed that if Epic removed the payment processing system, they would put the game back on the App Store. And oh my goodness guys, that's honestly insane. Apple has literally said all Fortnite has to do is remove the payment processing system and they could be back on the App Store within the next day. That's honestly so crazy. It's honestly crazy to think that if Epic Games wasn't so stubborn and they took away the direct payment system, Fortnite Mobile will be back on the App Store within the next day. But the reason you guys clicked on this video is to find the actual return release date for Fortnite Mobile on the App Store. And if we take a look at another tweet from FNBRHQ, it says, Apple vs Epic Games trial will be going until July of 2021. Goodbye, Fortnite Mobile. And guys, that basically confirms the fact that Fortnite Mobile won't be back until at least July 2021. How sad is that? So yes, guys, as you could see in that tweet, the Epic Games vs Apple court case is going to be going on until at least July 2021. So the official return release date for Fortnite Mobile is July 2021. How far away is that? Of course, if we do get any more updates, I'm going to be keeping you guys updated here on the channel. So make sure you are subscribed with the post notification bell turned on so you never miss another video. If you guys did go on to enjoy this video, telling you the new return release date for Fortnite Mobile on the App Store, make sure to smash the like button down below. And as I just said, subscribe to the channel with the post notification bell turned on. As always, feel free to join my Discord server, linked down below in the description, 
If you're not in the Discord server, what are you doing? Get yourself in there right now. Linked down below in the description. Also, feel free to follow me on Twitter or Instagram at IMAX Studios, and hopefully I can see you guys in another video. Goodbye.